Rising actor Alexander Okuma held a small group of guests spellbound with his emotional roller coaster one man drama titled Osaro over the weekend. And the actor, who is also known for his love for dancing and has featured in notable musicals, play out the anxious mind of a man awaiting response to a marriage proposal. Take a look. Actor, dancer, and choreographer Alexander Okuma dares the one man drama act at an open air garden in the heart of Lagos, southwest Nigeria. With an apparent clear sky and moderate guest, the actor takes on the title character of Saro and acts out the troubled mind of a young man about to propose to the love of his life. The adult theatre has been very challenging. However, it's been good because the challenges bring out the best in the actor. Uh, you know, I, I've before doing this, uh, I've been working with um, other productions like One Thousand Stories and um, other productions trying to do outdoor theatre. And one of the challenges has always been the ability to communicate and project so that the audience can hear you. Mm -hmm. So it takes a lot of training and, um, and hard work to make sure that one, you are clear enough, two, you are believable, and three, you carry the audience along because it's all about engagement with the audience. Don't get me started with the fact that I'm a Christian, she's a Muslim. Uh, don't even start that one because I was not ready to hear anybody. Even my church members were like, uh-uh, Osaro, she's a Muslim. How are you going to cope now? I did not, I didn't I even hear the last of it. My church members and pastors would call me and try to cancel me. I said, no. That was when my parents knew that, ah, how about this boy? I'm not going to change his mind. He wants to propose to his long, his long time girlfriend who he met in um, his youth service and he was not so sure on how to go about it because he was looking at the challenges he's facing all right, and how he's going to you know, um, make up for it. Is he ready for marriage? What if she says no? What if she says yes? So he was so confused but eventually he asked her by writing a letter and she gave her reply back. Okay, and while, while, she, while he was waiting, she said, do not open till 9 p.m. So he had to wait, you know, for another one hour to open that letter. And eventually, he opened and he got his answer. But wait, wait, wait. How did she know I, I was about to open it? I said it. I told you. Women are witches. They just know. I want to open it. She now decided to call. Oh, God. While the main plot is around Osaro getting a response to his proposal, the drama also addresses some other key issues, including love, courage, focus, religious tolerance, and many more. Directing this play was, um, was quite intriguing for me. Uh, the play had quite a lot of subject matter that we young people would like to talk about. And in, in this modern Nigeria, we have quite a lot of topical issues flying around here and there. Everybody just wants to rant, everybody wants to talk about how they feel. How about you bring it into the creative space and uh, generally the arts is a tool to mirror the society and the hammer with which is shaping it so that's why I, I feel like it was it was quite intriguing for me and it was insightful because it was it was just a means to talk about how we feel so some of the challenges we encountered while doing this was um, the ability to bring in all these topicals all these topical issue into 45 minutes one hour and that's quite a lot you know there's a whole lot to talk about and bringing them into this um, 45 minutes, 50 minutes, having people sit for a while, is, is, is a lot of work in Nigeria now, you know that. And um, yeah, basically bringing the issues together and putting them in the actor. And you know the actor, just one man actor, it's, it's, it's more tasking, putting all this issue in just one man. And yeah, the actor was quite, um, it was quite helpful, so it made the job a lot easier. No, no, she will not pick. I know it's Nima, she will not pick if I call her back. She will not pick. While the challenge of putting up a one-man show can be best imagined, Alexander appears to make a meal of it. It gets the crowd interested enough to get a significant interaction. See, you don't understand. You people don't understand what I'm saying. You are saying breakfast, I will not be the first. Oh, it's not easy. Oh. But if I say yes, or whether she says yes, I'm not even ready. But if I wait till I'm ready, I'm not even to be careful. The first show was a bit um, slow in terms of turnouts, 
But as the show progressed, the, the second uh, show, the audience grew. And today we had the first show today being Sunday, we had a good full turnout. And this now look at the audience. This audience was fast. This audience has been the most interactive because they kept on following from the beginning to the end. Finally, Osaro opened his letter and got his answer, which got the guest excited. Thank you very much. Put your hands together for Alex Okuma.